So guys, what's going on? It's Curtis Jack here, back again with a brand new video on this channel. And today we're off to watch Swansea City versus Middlesbrough in the Sky Bet Championship. And Swansea City, still no manager yet. Alan Sheehan is still the interim manager. We are two unbeaten under him. We needed that win against Rotherham United last Saturday. But then a dull 1-1 draw at Stoke City, which I thought was a steal, to be honest with you. Harry Darling rescuing it late on, cancelling a Daniel Johnson penalty. And... Yeah, we're against a strong Middlesbrough side today and we need a better performance than Tuesday because I wasn't particularly impressed with the performance against Stoke City. So, yeah, but hopefully it'll be unbeaten in four. Like, we won one and drew two in our last three games since the Leeds United defeat. So, yeah, hopefully now we can stay unbeaten in four and get the three points and hopefully... It will be Alan Sheehan's last game as interim manager and the new boss will be there for the Preston game. Come on, the Swans. Okay, so the team's been out now and we've made two changes from the Stoke City draw where Bashir Humphreys and Liam Walsh come in for Jerry Yates and Charlie Patina respectfully. I don't know what team Sheehan is um, playing and I really don't know what formation he's trying to play here, but we've got Carl Rush with and goal, wing-backs of Josh Key, and Josh Tyman. Um, centre backs trio of Ben Cabango, Harry Darling, and Bashi Humphreys, Liam Walsh, and Jay Fulton, and Matt Grimes in midfield, with Jamie Patterson and Jamal Lowe up top together. So, yeah, really don't know what formation Sheehan's trying to play here, but Nathan Wood makes his return to squad as well. He's on the bench today, and yeah, we've got a few game changes on the bench for Middlesbrough. Tough game, obviously really good team I and mean, we might carry a good manager as well hopefully we can make it unbeaten in four it'll be nice if we get three points oh nice go on yes oh lucky go on go on go on boss Few minutes before half time as well, typical. 1 0 Middlesbrough, Sam Greenwood breaking a deadlock. Just defence is caught out completely. Sam Greenwood, great run from him, and he slots a home pass, Carl Rushworth. Half time at the Swansea Dockham Stadium, Swansea 0, Middlesbrough 1. Typical, really. Sam Greenwood's breaking a deadlock. We've been linked to him a few times as well in the past. And yeah, it was, it was just no one watching him really. He made the perfect run to guide him past Carl Rushworth. Need a strong second half now. I didn't think we were too bad to be honest with you, but stronger second half needed. We've got like Ollie Cooper, Liam Cullen, Jerry Yates, Charlie Patino, Jan Balassi, fair few names to change the game over. Hopefully we can see one of them. Hope and I mean at half time, hopefully there can be a couple of changes made. Because we are lacking a bit of pace and attacking options. I mean, Walsh has had a decent game as well. We've had a couple of big chances from Liam Walsh and yeah, hopefully second half we can come out stronger and get a result. Come on, Luke! Yes! Yeah! Come on! Goals like champs! 1-1! One, one. What a cross of Josh Tyman and Jamal Lowe diving there to equalise the goal! Come on! The first sub of the first team sub and Ollie Cooper comes on for Liam Walsh. Come on, 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 after a back pass, so uh, this could be very dangerous. All source players on the line, pretty much. And yeah, how will send? Right, back pass, and they've capitalised on it. God's sake, Rushworth. Silvera makes a two one to Middlesbrough. Stupid mistake from Carl Rushworth. What is he doing there? We've been a better side second half, but that mistake could be the turning point now. Oh, we have to do it all again now. And also we've got Yannick Balassi coming on as well. He used to be an ex-Middlesbrough player as well, by the way. 
so a couple more subs now with Liam Cullen and Charlie Pettino set to be. A double substitution for We don't appear to be losing. And Middlesbrough are having a couple of changes. Keepers as well. Tom Glover coming off for Senny DM. So there are guys, it's finished Swansea 1, Middlesbrough 2. I didn't think we deserved to lose that really. Just that shocking Carl Rushworth mistake. Back pass picked it up. Can't accept a mistake like that really, but he'll learn from it, I'm pretty sure. I mean, I'll let um, Rushworth off pretty much because it's the first time he's made a mistake like that really, but if it was Andy Fisher, it'd be a different story. But yeah, it's mental that mistakes like that cost through the game. I didn't think we deserved to lose out. I mean, Josh Tymon was absolutely superb today, and I thought that was his best game in a Swansea City shirt. And it's good to see Jamalo back on the score sheet as well. I think it was a good performance in general, but it's just so frustrating that we didn't get anything out of this game. But I think we deserved something out of that game we did. But yeah, apparently I've seen the report that we are close to hiring a new manager. It might be as early as next week, which I hope is Chris Davis because he knows a lot about the club already. But as long as it's not like Nathan Jones or something like that, it's just please not Nathan Jones. But yeah, Chris Davis hopefully will be our boss. And we're back here on Friday night. We face Preston North End. And this will be our last home game of 2023. So yeah, if you want to see more fun, make sure you like this video, subscribe to our positions, and yeah, see you soon. Peace.